Hi everybody, Captain Kevin Lanier here from KC Sport Fishing out of Mexico Beach, Florida. I wanted to come to you today with a few more quick shortcut tips for your Simrad Evo 3 multifunction display. A lot of us knows the capability of these units, but sometimes we don't know some of the shortcuts. So I wanted to show you a couple. First thing I want to talk about is screen pairing. It's pretty simple to pair a screen, and most of you know how to do this by pressing the add button here. And then we take and we drag the ones we want to pair together onto the screen. So we've got our nav and our chart, and we've got those together. We press save, and then it goes on to our main screen as an option that we can use later. There it is right here. But there's another way to do that. If you want to do something that you don't already have set up, but you want to see a paired screen quickly, what you do is you go in here and you press one of the icons and hold it. What that does is that automatically gives you that particular option paired with all the other options you have available on the unit. So we're gonna to touch this one right here and we're looking at our nav mode and our chart at the same time. Really cool option if you wanna do something quickly. Well, another one of the shortcuts that a lot of guys don't know about, and maybe you do, but I wanted to show you if you're into one of your screens and you're working and you want a drop down menu real fast, just touch the top of the screen and drag your finger down. It gives you a standby mode, a brightness mode, the instrument bar. A lot of guys want to know how do I make my screen bigger or how do I see more? Well, just touch the instrument bar and it goes away. Those are just little things you can do with additional drop. The last thing I want to show you today is to how to make your chart give you more information about what's actually happening under the boat. So if you're trolling along and looking at your chart, this is something else you can do. Our boat is equipped with a B175HW 1000 watt transducer made by Airmar. And we also have the Navico Active Imaging 2-in-1 transducer that is transom mount, which gives us our side and our down scan structure. Well, as you're trolling along and you have your chart up, if you don't want to split your screen and look at your sonar and your chart at the same time, you do have an option that's available. <clears throat> when you're on the boat and moving along, you go to your screen menu button and you hit overlay options. This will give you the ability to overlay anything on your chart that you have available on the boat. Well, in this particular case, we want to overlay our structure. When we do that, as our boat moves along our chart, you will see a tagline behind it that gives you real-time bottom contouring. So if you're looking for that rock pile or things on the bottom while you're trolling, that is an easy way to do it besides using your traditional sonar. There's a lot of little features that are available. Another thing that you can overlay is your radar. When you're out here and you have, and you want to overlay your radar and see weather that might be in the area, you can do that as well. However, an additional piece of equipment that you need to overlay your radar is your Precision 9 compass. That's a very important part of the whole system in my opinion. So those are just a few other options and shortcuts that you can utilize while having your Simrad Evo 3 display on the boat and just make your day that much better. So I hope you've enjoyed this and until next time, have good fishing.